Hey guys, I am back with a Traveler's Notebook process video and I'll be using the November Citrus Twist Kit for this two page layout. So I received a Christmas card from my Lola or my grandmother who lives in the Philippines and this is a recent photo of my dog, Gamay. Now Gamay means in Bisaya like small or little because she was the runt of the litter. So. I mean, I, at first when I heard her name, I, I I didn't really like it, but I'm used to it. And I thought, well, it suits her, so she's used to the name. I don't like to change a pet's name if they're already used to a name that's already been given to them. So I was fine with that name, but I'm sure some of you might find it weird, which is understandable. So I did back that photo with one of the pattern papers, which is like a plaid paper and just to brighten that photo up in this layout and luckily fortunately I'm really happy I get to use those dog ephemeras that came in the jelly bean ephemera pack because I had no idea when I was going to use those if <laughs> if I ever will use those so I decided to use all four of those puppy ephemeras and just place it all over well on on the bottom of that first page and then on top and bottom of the second page just to make it seem balanced I guess <laughs> so if you are curious she is half Shih Tzu and half Pomeranian her father is a huge purebred Pomeranian and her mother is a Shih Tzu and I'm sure some of you who have seen my earlier process videos probably do recognize her. So in, in, the, early, in the earlier process video, she was a puppy and I was still in the Philippines at the time. So now that she's two and a half, I just, I can't believe that she's a little bit bigger now. <laughs> and I hope I get to see her soon because I did want to bring her back with me, but the veterinarian didn't recommend it because of her size and putting her under the stress and the drugs on a very long flight would possibly kill her so I decided not to do that but she did say I could do it when she's a little bit older possibly um, a year and a half and older depending on her size so when I hopefully when I do um, return to the Philippines to visit maybe I might bring her back I mean it just I'm the type of person that doesn't really like to um, stress a pet out um, when it comes to moving. Well, if it can't if it can't be helped, like if you're moving from a different house to house, that's a different story. But if it's like a different country to another country, I kind of second guess myself on that. But we'll, we'll see. Hopefully, maybe. <laughs> so I did use this old card from an old collection by Basic Gray from the Hello collection and it was part of one of those pocket cards and I decided to use it because it had December 13 on it. I did do this layout last night because so I don't have to worry about it today so I can just do the voiceover and I do my journaling on that particular card and I did want to add some um, word stickers to this um, layout because on on the top part of that photo I felt like it was still empty even though I do have that high gamai above it so I just wanted to add those word stickers on on the top portion of that photo just to brighten up just a little bit more and it, and I just added love you always and then back to the journaling card I didn't want to use the stamp set that was in the kit because none of the words I it just didn't go well with this layout so I just picked out a different stamp set and I used when I think of you and that is pretty much it for this layout and I hope you guys liked it and I will see you in the next video bye guys